What's good YouTube, it's your boy, Dinusa, more than just a pen, gang, gang. Now today's video, I am gonna be drawing a Danish X Factor judge called Blackman, Thomas Blackman. The reason why I am drawing more Danish people these past couple of weeks is simply because I am Danish and I do wanna build an audience here in Denmark. I live here now. I've been living here for the last six years. And for the first six years that I've been living here, I wasn't really focused on my Danish audience. You know what I mean? I wasn't really focused on, let me build an audience in this country simply because Danish only gets stuck in Denmark. Whereas I'm more international, I'm more, I speak English in my videos. So I was like, let me focus on the, the world, you know, everyone. Um, but now I've decided, you know, let me start focusing a bit more in my home country. Yes, I'm black, I know I'm black. Both my parents are Gambian, but I was born here. This was my first language that I ever spoke, you know, and I obviously lived in the UK for 17 years. And then I came back to Denmark six years ago and I'm living here currently. So that's the reason why you guys are seeing me draw more Danish people, more Danish influencers and, and Danish celebrities, as you can call it. The reason why I'm also doing this is because I can gain knowledge by doing this, you know what I mean? I'm gaining more knowledge about my culture, not my culture, but my home country. You know, I'm starting to know more people and celebrities, a lot of these celebrities that I'm drawing, I never knew, I never heard their names before. I'm like, who's that? And obviously I have to type it all on Google. So I get to do a little bit of research, background check on like who these people are, you know, and then that's it. I'm, I'm gaining knowledge, which is a good thing. Um, especially if I'm planning to live here, it's good that I know the people in the country and hopefully make a name for myself in this country as well. That's a plan of mine. So yeah, that was one of my goals this year to really build up my audience here in Denmark. So that's the reason why I'm doing it. I thought, let me just give you guys a quick explanation. You know, normally I just drop the time lapse on you guys, but today I thought let me pick up the camera, talk to you, let you know what's going through my mind and why I'm drawing a lot of Danish celebrities, influencers, all that shizness. Um, so yeah, now you're updated. Anyways, let's get into this time lapse. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and hit the video with a thumbs up. Let's go. So that is it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to smash the thumbs up. If you ain't already subscribed, please hit the subscribe button and I will catch you guys in the next video. I had a lot of fun with these sketches. I'm really enjoying sketching at the moment in time, you know, doing it every day. It's a lot of fun, it's good practice. And I feel like my proportions and portrait drawings are getting better and better. 
just from sketching every single day and i hope some of you guys are getting influenced in order to try it as well you know even if it's just an hour 45 minutes you know because sometimes when you're in the zone you can go up to two three hours it's still a sketch you know but just take your time and just give you something like short start off with like 30 minutes a day because if you go into like two hours you're always going to be like do i have two hours today to do a sketch whereas 30 minutes we all have 30 minutes to spare in a day to do what we love i guess that's why you're here on this channel because you love art so you should have 30 minutes a day to do what you love and just sketch and if you're in the zone just keep going just keep going why stop why anyways i'll catch you guys in the next video thank you for watching peace